How's it going guys? Shellblogs here. Have you guys ever been watching your favourite YouTuber or Twitch streamer? They've been playing Roblox and you've noticed their Roblox gameplay is in this kind of low poly, low texture type of mode where none of the textures are showing and it's just like a blank colour, just like a normal plastic brick you'd get in Roblox Studio. Well in this video I'm going to be showing you guys how to do that. This is a Windows tutorial so this works on PC and every Roblox game you play will actually be this low texture mode and it actually looks pretty cool if you've got like a bad computer it will help boost up your games the fps will be a lot higher it's um it looks pretty cool as well sometimes you actually get an advantage of games because there's less shadows and stuff like that and i actually kind of like the look of it so to start off with this video i'm just in a game of arsenal this works on every single roblox game it works best on games like arsenal the streets phantom forces you guys get the idea what i want to do is just deploy and just kind of show you guys what i mean so like all of these textures right here so this brick texture, the sand texture, the sky texture, you can actually remove all of these and get the game into a really low texture mode. And to be honest, I really like how this mode looks. It looks kind of like old Roblox, like 2007 stuff, but I still really like how it looks. So yeah, in this video, I'm gonna show you guys how to do it. But like I said, this is for Windows. I don't know if you can do this on Android or iPhone. If you can, then I'll probably make a video on that in the future. So what we're going to do guys is we're going to start off on our desktop. You want to find the Roblox icon either just on your desktop like this or you can even find it in the search feature. But you want to right click Roblox and you want to click on open file location. Now you should be greeted with this screen. Um, if you aren't I'll show you guys how to get it the second way. So to get it the second way, you literally just search for Roblox player. Um, you find it in here, you right click and you just do open file location. And it might come up like this, so then you simply just do it a second time, right click, open file location. So you guys should be at this screen right now because I showed you both methods on how to get to it. And what you actually want to do is you want to double click on platform content. Then we're going to choose PC as we're playing on a PC. And we're going to go into textures and we are going to find every single Roblox texture in here. So go back to your desktop just for a second, right click and then click on new and select folder. What you want to call this folder is Roblox textures backup. Now the reason we do this is because if you decide you want your texture just back you don't have to reinstall the whole game you can just drag and drop the files across so roblox textures back up just like this press enter and there you go we've got a folder you can put this in your documents downloads folder it doesn't have to be on a desktop i'm just using that for an example and we're going to stay in this roblox folder and we want to select everything now you can literally select everything you want to some people like water or sky or ice and they leave those behind if you want to leave something behind you can just hold control maybe i'll just leave water behind for this video but we're going to select everything else and we're going to put it in the roblox textures backup make sure you tick the box click on to continue you must have administrator access and it's going to transfer everything from your roblox files onto your desktop file and there you go we should actually have it running right now obviously we're going to test a few roblox games just to make sure it works but it is actually quite easy to get roblox in this weirdly weird low texture mode so like I said guys, you can leave water, you can leave ice and sky as well if you want to. I like to remove sky because I like the sky looking fairly basic. What we're going to do now, we're going to play some Roblox games and I can show you guys exactly how it looks. Okay, so let's start off with Arsenal. You guys saw what it looked like at the start of the video with all of those textures and stuff like that. Let's go ahead and play it and let's see if it's in this low poly mode. So as you can see guys, behind my character, it's looking pretty basic already. We actually want to open up the Arsenal settings. You want to go onto display right here. We're gonna turn off shadows and it's gonna look even more basic. You guys can turn more stuff off. I also want you to go into the official Roblox settings and just make sure your graphics quality is all the way up. You can turn it down, but it's gonna basically just look a bit more pixelated. So I'd recommend having this all the way to the top. Let's go on deploy, let's select our team. And as you can see, it's very basic. It kind of looks like some Lego type game, some like downgrade of Roblox. But as you can see, I'm on a solid 60 FPS. Um, obviously my PC can run that anyway, but you guys get the idea it's pretty cool if you have got some basic laptop this actually might help you out quite a bit another game to check out is the streets you can kind of already turn on this mode i'm um, just in the street settings but it's still interesting to see what it looks like because all of the textures that are normally here um, would actually be replaced 
Okay, so the reason why I wanted to play this is because it does already have a low texture mode. The only difference is we can't really change the textures of these models. So if I click the button, we can see they go to cubes. That's just something the streets made. But apart from that, we can't really change much. But you can see there isn't really much of a difference. It still looks pretty cool. Now, I also wanted to show you guys what Sword Fights on the Heights looks like. And the thing is, it kind of looks the same. If you guys play this game a lot, you might notice the studs that are on the base plates right here. They have actually disappeared. But apart from that, it's pretty much the same game. Um, I kind of like this texture thing because it looks like old Roblox. Um, obviously, this game's quite old. So it looks like, you know, 2007, 2009 Roblox. Yeah, this game didn't really change at all. It's mostly just good for games that have tons and tons of textures added to them. Okay, so Phantom Forces. It's actually looking really basic already. Um, I guess you don't really notice too much. As you can see, the sky's completely gone. That looks kind of crazy. Um, yeah, I don't know. I kind of like this, actually. It feels a lot more like a Lego game. Um, see if I can get some kills. Probably can't. Oh, got one guy and he got sniped. Um, but yeah, there you go. This is what it looks like. I'll see if there's any other games to test it on. But if you guys want to try this, it's very easy to do. And it can make your game run a lot faster. And before I end this video, if you guys want your textures back, you don't have to reinstall Roblox. All you do is double click your file on your desktop or wherever you put it, select everything and just drag and drop it back into the original Roblox file. And also in Driving Simulator as well, the palm trees look kind of cool. Obviously all of the textures from pretty much everything has gone now. So there you go guys, that is pretty much it for this video. That is how you play Roblox in low poly mode. I kind of like it, I think it looks quite cool, especially on some games like this in Arsenal. It's kind of nice. If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to leave a like, subscribe if you're new. Thanks for watching and I will see you guys in the next one.